people are really picking up on it, especially in other regions outside of NA. And right here, we've got the bow going up against the sword and the guitars. Guitars, to me, are super busted, but we're going to see what happens here <laughs> in this game. <laughs> Yeah, Katari's can be really strong in the right hands. That Gimp potential, those half pipes can be so devastating. But one of the things that it struggles with is building up that damage. If you go blow for blow, Katari's will generally struggle. And we'll see if Amaze can kind of make sure that they at least uh, that she at least gets those trades or maybe even trades out uh, more effectively. Because right now she is getting that damage lead just barely over dummy. Yeah, definitely. Amaze is doing their thing right here with the Rocket Lance. The Rocket Lance slept on by a lot of people, but it's been making waves in the competitive scene as of late with a lot of different players. Honestly, I want to just pick and choose who who it is, but Dummy sent off the side. Went out for the Ooh, neutral okay. light gravity cancel, but no good from Amaze. Got the bow in Ooh. hand. Gravity cancel with the down sig, and that's going to be the first stock, the stutter step to strut and show <laughs> sure dominance. Did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's definitely very humble. I was seeing on Twitter just before our block that Kyler Alice was praising her, saying like, okay, this might be the one that Amaze wins. And she was like, you know what? I'm still nervous. I, I, I still think that there's that potential for the lower bracket run, but holy cow, that edge guard and Amaze oh. is going to get a massive gimp. All right, she's looking good. What a gimp and the recovery. You can't, you know, can't sleep on that recovery. Getting back up there, using the dodge perfectly to touch that edge was so good. And look at Dummy trying to take this stock, but still getting pieced up with straight hands. And there we go. And neutral light in the air is going to take it out. And the Dummy finally got that first stock out of there. Katars are going to be able to neutralize this game, but we're going to have to see some aggression to get this thing popping. Nice neutral right now. Here we go, okay. finally got the loop started. Okay, but Amaze able to slap him, make sure that they uh, deny that string from getting too big. That's it. You got to look for those moments to get out of the Qatar loops, man. That's where the big damage comes from. That's where your boy gets scared when I'm fighting against a Qatar player. And anybody else, even at this level, I believe they're scared when they get in those loops. Ooh. Nice damage. Caught him with recovery. And chasing in the air. Amaze is really getting this that. stock torn up. Okay. Here we go. Now, now we're in kill okay. range. Uh, <laughs> KO range. Oh, my goodness. The neutral sig gonna take out dummy's last stock and we got one oh amaze showing signs of why kyler alice is in the loser side of the bracket yeah amaze looking really good one thing i was nervous about with this vector pick is those signatures right you can't really go straight into them off of a hit the way that you can with some of the other characters in the game but amaze showing she knows exactly where to use it just like that that gravity cancel d sig and then we had that n sig to finish it off um, so she really is intelligent about the way that she's using those things, not really just going for the obvious kind of like uh, down light end sig on the bow or the side light end sig for the lance. Mm -hmm. That black and red vector when they're in the ship mode, it looks really <laughs> sick. <laughs> Gotta call that it's out. It's a cool skin. Definitely. All right, so to start this off, this is a great look, right? No weapon in the hands of Amaze. Starving, got the swords and the guitars, both great weapons against uh, unarmed. And got some good damage, but not a big lead going into getting this rocket lance from Amaze. Oh, snap. Amaze with the movement. Doing some tricky stuff there. Now she's got the edge control, but she's going to back off a little bit. Dummy's still not able to get past this corner. Still stuck next to the wall. This is really good positioning for Amaze, but Dummy gets around it. Yeah, it was very good control for a moment there. Still got the lead, does Dummy, but here we go. Tried to drop the eggs on him. No good. And oh, was that a weapon toss in to snatch it right back up? It was so quick. I didn't even see the weapon leave Amaze's hands. Yeah, she followed right alongside it. But unfortunately, couldn't get a lot out of it. Definitely secured the landing, which is nice. D-Light into the recovery. Not even going to put Dummy off screen. So Amaze struggling a little bit here as Dummy gets the first KO. Amaze went for the Haymaker. Yeah, the one that will make me cheer. But uh, dropped a tear as that first stock went down. Dom, Dummy is doing very good with these guitars. Scary, scary weapon. Here it is. Yeah. Caught the dodge. And we're just racking up damage. Caught them. Just chasing Amaze everywhere they go. Wow. I... Did not see that KOing. I knew it was going to hit, but I didn't see it KOing. And there we go. We've got an even game. A little bit more damage on a maze. And we'll see what Dummy can do about it. Dummy's doing a really good job with the Katars catching uh, the dodges of a maze. Oh, snap. And the recovery. Beautiful. And that's how you make quick work of the stock, right? 
Yeah, that was really well done from Dummy. This is now a big lead. Dummy, looking ready to take game number two. Dummy snatching up some damage. There we go. Like I like that retaliation, right? You're looking for the dodge, and Dummy said, no, nah, I'm going to sidelight right into you. Ooh, and that might have been it. That, oh, yep, yep, yep. If you can get over to the other side, nope. Good. <laughs> that was a good try with the weapon toss, but not going to work out. Still a lot of damage on a maze. Dummy trying to fight off. Thought he was going to dodge into him. No, sir. Tried to hit the haymaker. Not going to be a good read there. But here we okay. go. There we go. A maze fighting back. This is we want to see oh. she wanted it but the recovery from dummy is gonna take game number two dummy looking really good in this one yeah dummy looked amazing in game two 595 damage only took 289 that was a great great game amaze it still showed already in game one that they can still uh handle what they have thrown at them but She's going to have to really pop it out in this last one. Right here, it's going to be game three. Switching to the Koji. I like it. We got a Suri Koji. Two pretty quick legends. Uh, we're on the lower side of the defense, right? I see the, dev the defense pip on the Koji to make sure you don't get KO'd too quick. Uh, I like that. I like that's a good pick. It ends up neutralizing because the Suri uh, is in the attack stance. So it ends up just going five to five and basically uh, amounts to not much, but it is going to help keep that Koji alive. Um, it is interesting that Amaze is making the swap over the Koji. Wants to retain that bow, but maybe a little bit more consistency with this sword play. Yeah, I was seeing a little bit of... Uh... The tide would shift a bit when the sword would come out. Maybe I mean it was the Katars that were the main deal, but the sword was kind of dealing with the with the uh, rocket lance a bit. So yeah, I understand you want to go sword for sword and then bow whenever you need it. And here we are, looking pretty even here, right? Like this is good neutral when you can neutralize a weapon with its own uh, own skills. Oh yeah. my goodness, went off on the side, tried to get a you know, side light, but no good. Nice Nair gonna punish that whiffed recovery from Dummy. Amaze, ooh, is gonna get punished for that. And the Haymaker to follow up. Dummy gets the first stock pretty quick. My goodness. And, and that's what they tried in the last game, right? You saw Dummy do that. It just hit the sidelight and then went straight for the Haymaker. Thought they were gonna dodge in. And Amaze, she did dodge in this time and got clobbered. But still some good damage. Just keep from getting Wake hit up. by these Katars. If you, you keep getting clipped, you're gonna eat too much damage to really bring this game back to even. Oh, but a nice, nice D-Sig. Not going to be enough to finish off Dummy, but the side air will do it. Amaze able to bring this back to even stocks. She did take a little bit of damage here. We'll see if she can find something big. Oh, went for the N-Sig read. Almost caught Dummy, too. Almost caught. If it was held a little bit longer, it would have worked out. But here we are, and Dummy sort is looking really, really nice <laughs> right now. Recovery's going to touch, and big damage sitting on Koji. Oh, that's not a good look. That extra oh. pip is not going to save you from that double sair. You're going to be out of there. Here we are. Two to one on the stocks. Dummy's got the lead. Amaze looking for a weapon. Nice way to evade around. Got touched one time and got the sword. And we're going to have to fight back. Yeah, Amaze is starting to struggle here. Good dodge through. As the stage control, just going to get a little bit of damage. Fake out with that ground pound. Dummy's going to get back up safely. Amaze hasn't taken any damage for a hot minute, but still not getting the big momentum that she had in game number one. Oh, and exactly. drops it. Whew, trying really tough. I like it. The sword okay. is looking really nice right now. This is what we need. It's been like kind of touch, touch, and it's like tag, right? Just get a touch here and there and run away. But I uh, wasn't getting big combos. Good, uh good sequences of damage and got some but right back out of dummy and that dummy's trying to Where's close this bad boy out yeah dummy's one hit away from taking this amaze with a nice snare gonna interrupt still she's a full stock behind and dummy just needs to find that one move drops the delight recovery just got the tip of the sword but that one will do it dummy gonna take game number three is now one game away from going into the grand finals and that's exactly where you want to be. We talk about it. Every game talks about it. You want to go to the grand finals and be safe up there and not have to lose a set and go down what? to the loser side. My goodness. Yeah, that, that double stare was so good. And here we go. Boom. That I like the idea of the gravity cancel. If he dodged down, uh, you know, it would have caught. But Dummy was like, nah, I'm going upwards and was able to catch a punish on it. Mako. Oh, Mako. My goodness. So... Three character swaps in one set. That is a... Uh, you don't see it a lot. 
Yeah, it's something that uh, I think Foda and I both agree that like this is not a good look when you do it. Like it, it's not it showing a confident person who knows their character and knows what they need to do to adjust. Instead, it's them kind of like throwing darts at a wall. That being said, Amaze looked really strong with that initial greatsword string. So maybe this dart is the one to find the bullseye. I hope it is, right? You don't want to hit a eight. You want to hit the bullseye, right? You're down two to one. And Dummy is looking really good, especially when that sword touches the hands. Even the guitars are looking nice. And I love Ooh! that sequence coming out from Amaze's great sword. Ooh, if we saw a neutral no, sig on that no. gravity cancel, it could have been it, but it's still going to take the stock. Nice job. And we're going to opt to keep the great sword. I love that great sword string. Unjumpable went for the optimal route there. Launched Dummy and then still ended up getting that KO. Really well done from Amaze, showing she's uh, she's not just a one-trick with the bow or the lance. Yeah, that's actually really impressive to be able to play multiple weapons at this level. This great sword is looking really good. I love the way the neutral is being played. Just poke around, do dodge out with the jump cancels. Okay, and here we go. Dummy coming through with those guitars, looking as good as they've looked in game two and three. Here we oh, go. Nice the piece. Sig. Wow. Of all things, I wasn't looking for that one. I was looking for more string, but went straight through the body and came through with the side Sig to the left. Yeah, really smart from Dummy. Recognized the movement of Amaze. Went for the D Sig, which covered that dash through from Amaze. But Amaze back on the guitars. Showing she's got some damage of her own. Not quite in KO percent for Dummy, but good spot for Amaze. The left right dance from the guitars looks so hilarious, <laughs> and I love it. Battleboards. <laughs> It's so good. All right, here we go. We got the chainsaw back in hand. D Sig. There we go. All right, what we got? Here's the chase. Oh no! We had the sweat beads. Oh. Tried to bait the dodge, but Dummy was not going for it. She had the dare. Could have gone for the dare nair. That's one of those places where you go for it a lot. But the recovery will still KO. Amaze is gonna juggle. Likely will stick with the great sword. Yep, and then has a prime to second one. Yes, sir. All right. Another haymaker. All right. I like it. I like it, dummy. That's one of my favorite things to see hit is a haymaker. It's, that's that. That's where you're really showing dominance, showing that you got the game in the palm of your hands. But amazing. Looking really good. Look at this movement coming out with the great sword. So good at the resets. Ooh. Unfortunately, didn't catch the dodge of dummy, so he was able to dodge up and out of it. But still, Amaze is getting these hits, adding up this damage, doing a really good job of resetting when she doesn't connect. Almost had it, yeah. Those resets were looking good. I like that idea, that? but just a little shy. Still chasing. Tried to get the dare, but oh, the Sarah from Dummy going to hit. And now we've got even stocks, but the damage is a little lopsided. The answer is going to be how quick can Amaze get a weapon. And boom, instantly. <laughs> nice. Again, reading these dodges through from Amaze. Dummy getting some really good damage built up. Dummy, one stock away from going to the grand finals. Amaze trying to take this to game number five. No Stay. attacks, they're not from Amaze, but nice. she goes for the three. Oh, almost! I like that attempt. I feel like that should have landed, but the active frames just kind of didn't come out in time to land and hit Dummy. Here we go. Now oh. we're back in neutral, looking good. Well, that's a punish. Disarmed, Amaze in trouble, Dummy. A D-Light recovery might not do it. A D-Light dare recovery could be close, though. The Nair not going to put her off screen. Amaze needs a weapon. Really bad. Oh, my oh, goodness. Oh, that recovery was really close to fully connecting, but doesn't get it. There we go. Nice Ooh. weapon toss. The Sair. And there we go. We got 2-2 two -two on the board. Amaze staying alive. Great recognition. Saw that dummy through his weapon, but got caught. And so she saw, okay, I get to be aggressive here. Chased after it. First stock, dummy did kind of throw away. Let's be real. He ground pounded a little early. He was really hoping that was going to hit. But still, well done from Maze. Not sure if she's stuck with the Mako, though. I don't know, right? Yeah, I've talked about this on here before in this game. This is one of the games where you can switch characters on a dub. But we're That's still going to stick with the Mako. Looks like she was liking what she was doing with the Great Sword. Going to be sticking with it as we go into game number five. Winner of this goes into the Grand Finals. Guaranteed top two finish. Will it be a maze for her first top two finish in 1v1s in a major? Or will it be Dummy? Dummy's looking good to start off, but finally grabs the Great Sword. And you're saying you looking good with the Mako, man. Looking good with the Great Sword. Here we go. Swinging away. Trying to get some hits. But the way that... 
this poke and run coming out from dummy is looking really nice to start this off. Already got a maze on orange. Here we go. Let's get a sequence. No, it. and able to dodge out. Perfect read. Yeah. Dummy doing a really good job making sure he doesn't get caught on that dodge. A maze not able to read that movement. Dummy. Backs off, going over to the sword, knows that he almost has a maze in that KO percent, so a D-Light recovery could do it soon. Mm -hmm. This is definitely the KO weapon of Asuri. Not that Katars can't KO, but this is the one you want in your hands. The Sayers have really been doing it in this set. Nice oh. gravity cancel, but wasn't able to get the KO. Here we are. Oh, neutral. Still going to be alive. That movement. Dare. Okay. Oh. I mean, there wasn't really much else to pull out of that bag. I think there was about two tricks in there. Tried the D-Light and, I mean, the Dare, and it did not work. Dummy was able to steal that stock. Here we go. Amaze fighting against unarmed Dummy. Un Dummy versus, got the Katars. We got Katars versus Katars. And we're getting some good damage on Amaze's side. Amaze going in with the D-Sig. Starting to get a little greedy here. Dummy not going to get KO'd by any of these SIGs just yet. Yeah, trying to just cover space, right? Like, use the SIGs that just cover cover area, but the dodges are well-placed. Look at that one right there from Dummy. They're just in the perfect spot so where you're not getting what you want. Wow, oh, we're no! seeing actually a lot more SIGs. Oh, my Dodged gosh. into the SIG from Dummy. Amaze on her final stock here in game number five of the winner's final. Dummy looking ready to take this and go on into the grand finals. Oh, nice read. All right, nice. denies the three stock. They're not the three stocks. All right, here we go. This stock is going to have to be really, really well done. I like it. Read the dodge, but the dodge came back really, really fast, honestly, and was able to get out of the next sequence. Here we go. Trying to fight back against Dummy Sword, and Dummy Sword has been looking really, really good. He's trying to get some decent damage built up, but she's a full stock behind. This is just such a tough spot to be in. The fact that Dummy's still finding damage, able to trade out, in fact... Great efficiently. It's gonna be real tough for a maze. Goes for the ground pound, dummy. Ooh. Outside of it. That was so Punish. close. And I like the sig there. I, I'm not even gonna be upset at that. That was good. Wow, I like that for real. Turn around with Punish. the neutral light in the air, but gonna lose the stock to the Sayer. That's the story of the game. Sword closing out stocks and dummy going into grand finals. Amazing game from a maze. But we're going to go down to the lower side of the bracket. Yeah, she did very well for herself, of course. Uh, still inside the tournament. We're only in uh, the winner's or That was only in the winner's bracket. So she still has plenty of time. She's going to be sitting in the loser's final. Like, like we said, she has a guaranteed top three finish. But Dummy looked so strong in game number three. He was just hitting more frequently, getting more damage per engage. You can see there, 32 to the 19 of a maze. Definitely, definitely. You know, when you see 583 to 309 on the damage.